Welcome to my channel. This is The Real Dad of Los Angeles. I'm gonna just start here. If you've been around for the last two years, you know that things look completely different around here. So, here's what you need to know. If you're new, just understand there's about 100 videos, two years worth of videos that I had to completely remove from my channel as of today. So that's why things look the way they do. Um, there were some compliance issues with foster care and stuff like that, stuff I'm not gonna talk about because it's really not, it's confidential information. So just know that I've been on this journey for to become a parent, okay? I started with private adoption, then I decided to go into the foster care to adopt route, then I got really pissed off at everything, and then I decided to go to surrogacy and after that part of my life, you know, I was in a relationship and my partner didn't really want me to do the foster care thing because, well, he's a loser. And then I decided, you know, that broke off and then I decided to get back into foster care and it has been a roller coaster. There's been so many times I've helped people, you know, decide they want to do foster care, they don't want to do foster care. I've been now, I've fostered seven different infants. I currently have one in my care and I reunified six infants total over the last two years, almost two years coming up in December. So here's the thing. For all y'all who have been around since the beginning, there's over a thousand of you guys here. I gotta say, I'm sorry. I'm sorry that that content had to go away. I'm sorry that I you know, your guys' comments are not there for people to see. Please know, I want you guys to know I've seen all the comments. I haven't gotten to respond to them all because I've shared in the past that I don't like to respond to comments right away because I sit down and I go through and I respond personally to each one of them. I want you to know I've seen them though. Um, I, I had to remove it all. I had to remove all the thumbnails. I had to remove all the, the videos. I can go back and um, upload some of those videos to where the kids are completely, I mean completely taken off. Um, but it's, at this point, it doesn't seem, there's over 100 videos, so it doesn't seem like it'd be worth it. You'd see a ton of blurred screens. I just hope you guys can bear this out with me. Um, but for the sake of like confidentiality and my license, it all had to, it all had to go. So I'm revamping things around here. There will be more videos of me talking to the screen, educating people. I hope you guys like it, but we're not gonna get rid of the vlog stuff. Only thing that I was told is I just, I either have to severely, severely blur the children out of the screen, or I just can't have them on screen. They're infants, so they don't really need to be on the screen anyway. It's not like they're running around. I can still, you know, share my journey with you. Y'all know, like, I don't talk about these kids' lives. I don't share anything about their lives. Um, I, you know, I have said goodbye to some kids. I'm not even gonna be saying goodbye to the kids on the channel. That's a very vulnerable, intimate thing. The longer I've done this, the more I've realized I kind of want to keep that for myself and not really share that side of it. But also, because it is so freaking vulnerable, but also because it's just, it gets a little too much into their story and it's just something that I think we just need to not be talking about. I wanna really, really, really stress for the new people and those of us that have been here for this entire time, this is about my journey. This is about me becoming a parent, okay? There have been things thrown out there recently that I need to stop doing this. I have a big enough following that I need to do a GoFundMe campaign to support the surrogacy in Mexico. I don't know, guys. Comment and let me know what you guys think about that because that's a really important thing. Do I want to go the surrogacy route? Is foster care really for me? Or do I continue doing this? But it's just going to look completely differently. And I will say this. One thing that really hurts me is that there have been many times, and I've been feeling super down lately about this whole experience. There have been so many times like, like y'all have been my village. Like you, if they say it takes a village, like you guys have been my village. You guys have been the ones that comment to, to reach out, to encourage me, say, don't stop. You're so good at this. You're such a great parent. And I, that really freaking helps me. It really does. I see those comments. So it's like, it, it hurts because like, 
I feel like I, when I went through and got rid of all those videos, and if you go to my Instagram, oh my God, I, my Instagram doesn't look anything like it was because I had to go archive and get all the photos off of my Instagram, all the Instagram reels off my Instagram. And it freaking hurts because I just went through two years of seven babies and had to take it all away. And it literally brought me to tears because it's just memories and this journey of mine that I've been on and it freaking hurts. And I feel like I've taken you guys, like I have this responsibility, like I've taken you guys through this journey of like really rooting me on and loving these kids just as much as I have to now it has to all be washed away. I hope you guys can understand and forgive me if there's any forgiveness that's warranted and just like, please be my ride or die. Please stick it out with me. I'm gonna, this is gonna be different. Maybe I'll do more lives. I don't really know. I don't wanna do a ton of videos of me sitting in front of this screen and talking because it can kind of get bored. I'll try to do some Q and A's, flood the comments with questions because it's hard to do Q and A's when I don't have many questions or I have the same questions over and over. Remember, always confidentiality. This is not about the children. I will not be talking about their stories even more than I already did not. I'm going to still do some vlogs. Like if me and the baby goes out to, you know, go swimming, I'm still going to vlog it. I'm just going to either have them totally covered or I'm just going to like, oh, she's swimming right now. We'll figure it out. It's going to be a work in progress. I'm not even going to give the babies names. I'm not even going to, I don't know. I might do a letter. There's nothing wrong with a letter. I'm going to have to figure this out, but please stick it out. Thank you for being there. I'm sorry to all you new guys, new people. You haven't gotten to see like so much, but this is the best that I can do. I I might, I might go through and edit and re-upload some videos or something like that. We'll see, um, or go through the other ones. Like uh, YouTube allows us to edit our videos that are already up there. So I might do stuff like that. They're gonna be super choppy, but it's the best that I can do at this point, so. Thank you guys, um, but that's not gonna happen for any time soon. It's, let's just keep rolling through this. But thank you, I'm sorry guys. And please let me know in the comments what you think. And I'm also gonna, I'm gonna try and get more stuff out as soon as possible, but it's the best I can do. It breaks my heart. All right, peace out, bye.